Hello guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to set the self timer on the Nikon D5100. Here's my D5100 and in order to set the self timer to do uh, portraits of yourself or to get in the photo, it's quite easy. Firstly, obviously turn the camera on. Secondly, you want to get the info screen up, if it doesn't come up automatically, press the I button. Once that screen's up, press the I button again and you'll see you have this yellow icon on the side here and you can scroll through all these different settings. And the one you want is uh, the one called release mode, uh, which it says up here. So once you get to release mode, press OK and then you get a list of different options here you've got single frame continuous self timer and delayed remote obviously we want self timer and then press OK and that is on self timer now so when you take a photo and press the shutter button it will wait for five seconds in this case uh, before it takes the photograph now if you want it to last longer than five seconds you can actually change that in the menu so what we'll do is we'll press the menu button and then we'll come across to the pencil icon which is the third one down then we press across and we want C timers AE lock so we'll press OK on that and then we'll scroll down to the third one C3 self timer press OK and then it says self timer delay press your cross arrow and then you can choose from 2 seconds, 5 seconds, 10 seconds or 20 seconds. So I had it set on 5 seconds, I'm going to change that to 10. So I'm going to select 10, press OK. And you can also select the number of shots that the camera takes uh, when it's in self timer mode. And you can choose from 1 to 9. So if you're doing a group photograph and you want to be in the photo, you can set to take up to 9 photographs. Uh, with the self timer which is really good because there's always someone blinking or looking the opposite way when you do group photos so you can change that to however many you want as well and then once you selected it just press OK and then you can go back and you can see in the menu now that has now changed to 10 seconds if you want to get out of self timer mode once you've finished press the I button again scroll back down to the release mode and then put it back onto either uh, single frame or continuous or whichever one you want to change to. Once you've selected it, press OK and it's done. Okay guys, I hope that was helpful. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the box below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Cheers very much.